My name is Arcelli. If you're new here, I am a full-time engineer living in Germany and I love showing you guys what it's like to actually live here and do fun things in the city. So this weekend, I am actually planning some activities to go enjoy the city because I feel like I need to just get out of my little bubble. I love the Olympia Park neighborhood, but I feel like I need to go into the city maybe in some cool parts of town. I really want to go and hang out in Schwabing maybe this weekend, so just some fun things planned. So I would love to bring you guys along with me and I think today I am actually going to go to the Olympia Park and maybe take a long walk because I feel like I want to take advantage of the sunshine. It's a really cold day but it's such a beautiful day. It's so sunny and I really really miss the sun. So. I am going to go and take a walk, maybe take a book or my journal and listen to some good music because it's also nice to kind of take a solo date and go experience something on my own. So I'm going to go do that and bring you guys along with me. really cold and Patrick actually joined me he's now with me he's <laughs> so we're actually going to go grab something to eat because it's cold and we're hungry but it's really nice out today I'm sitting by the like student housing I think found a nice bench and it's such a beautiful day it's so sunny and peaceful but now I'm ready to go grab something to eat. So we're going to Oezy. There's a new burger place that opened up. It looks like a cool hipster burger place that reminds me of something I would see in Portland, Oregon. So let's go do that. So that's the student housing. I think, if I'm not mistaken, they're like the bungalows. My manager actually used to go there. <laughs> so there's a gorilla. They're really cool. They paint them. And we're just on this hill. And then there's some skateboarders over there. Cool. Good morning, it's a new day. We are actually heading out to try a new cafe in the Schwabing area. We're gonna take the bus and then we're gonna take the tram. And I actually really like taking this tram. It's the Zenlinger Tour one. So you get to see a lot of really pretty stuff along the way and you're not stuck underground like you would with an U-Bahn. So I'm really excited to just kind of take it easy today and see what we find. Um, I think that's the beautiful thing about living in a city like Munich is that you can 
take a walk and find really beautiful things and then I think it's just such a walkable city that's why I really like it once you get somewhere you can walk throughout the whole city and spend the whole day doing that so we're gonna do that until we get tired and bring you guys along with We had some nice uh, light breakfast at this coffee shop. I believe the name was Morsa and I had an espresso. Patrick got a latte or cappuccino, I think. And then we had some chocolate croissants and they were the fluffiest, like flaky croissants ever. They were so good. And then after that, we just kind of decided to pick a direction and walk. And it was so nice to enjoy the beautiful day. It was around, um, I think nine degrees celsius today so it was just really nice weather and it was so sunny so we did that and we stumbled upon some really cool shops and some other cafes we want to go back and try so i would take pictures of the things that we found along the way that we want to go back to so we found the coolest antique store ever it was actually in a basement and it was full of so many things that were like decades and decades old i thought it was so neat in there and we found it by accident because the entrance to it is this like hallway of mirrors that are displayed on the outside so like in the street it just goes into this alley of mirrors and then um we were checking out the hallway of mirrors and then when we turned around we noticed that there was like a sign for uh, an antique shop. So we actually found two pieces for our home. So the first piece is this beautiful marble piece. Such nice quality, like it's in perfect condition. I actually just need to clean it off and you open it up and it's this little container, which I'm going to use it as a jewelry holder. I'm going to put it upstairs on my dresser, but such a neat piece and such high quality. Like It's going to be really nice to keep for a long time. And then we're actually working on this gallery wall behind me, um, behind our couch that faces our TV and patio area. And I found this really neat um, print. It's actually like a textile print and they just framed it, but it's really old and it has like little carriages and horses and people dressed up in old timey clothes and it's Frauenkirche. It looks like it's in like the Marienplatz strip, which is really cool. So yeah, that was a cool find that we're going to add to this gallery wall. And I just love that about Munich is that you can just walk everywhere. It's so walkable and you'll find some really neat places. And one thing that we love to look at when we walk around is the architecture that's our favorite thing to do because it's so different from the u.s so 
we try to take advantage of just looking at really cool buildings and we found this beautiful church um again just by walking around and some other cool places that we've marked to go back to but it was so nice and now I think I'm ready to eat so we're actually going to make some food I think I want to make like a vegetarian vegan meal today and then just hang out let's get cooking Riding out the waves all the ebbs and flows used to bring me down I'm strong to toss me about I'm wiser